This morning, Houstonians are remembering a Liberty County Sheriff's deputy who was killed in the line of duty. Deputy Richard Witten died yesterday, nearly nine months after he was shot. A procession was held for him late last night. Channel 2's Vincent Crivelli is at the Texas Medical Center this morning with more on how he is now being honored. Vincent. Tonight, good morning. This tragic death was unexpected. Deputy Witten was undergoing physical therapy when he suffered a heart attack and passed away. Officers' lights shine bright for Liberty County Sheriff's Deputy Richard Witten, who passed away on Monday. Today we suffered a loss of a hero with the Liberty County Sheriff's Office. Deputy Richard Witten had a heart attack during therapy today and he was not able to be revived. Witten has been going through physical therapy after being shot in the neck while trying to apprehend murder suspect Paval Vito in May 2019. The bullet that struck his neck paralyzed most of his body. Witten would tell you when you talk to him, he said, you know, it was tragic what happened to me. But if I had to do it again, I'd do the same thing. Deputy Witten loved his family, his dog, and helping others. The Liberty County Sheriff says his service to the community will never be forgotten. The man that everybody loved, he kept in his patrol car. I was telling the chief he kept dog food and cat food and food for people, and he helped the stray dogs and cats and helped all the people that were homeless. I mean, he was just a very, very good man, and it's a very tragic loss for Liberty County Sheriff's Office. And Deputy Witten is survived by his wife, son, daughter, and grandchildren. This morning, they're asking for your prayers. Reporting live from the medical examiner's office, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News.